Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm gonna be doing a drugstore haul. I went shopping yesterday, the day before yesterday, and today all the drugstore I got Walmart, Walgreens, and Dollar General. I got a lot of stuff. I got this whole bag of stuff, and then I got two things down here. So I uh, first start with Walmart. I went to Walmart was that yesterday, the day before yesterday. So if you guys know, I'm natural with my hair, so I'm going to do a protective style for the winter time. Maybe like one month. The protective style I'm doing is yarn locks, fake uh, faux yarn locks. So I use I usually use black. I'm using black and burgundy for my yarn locks, and I'm so excited. This is the first thing I got from Walmart. This is some yarn for my hair. Next thing I got from Walmart is this set of combs. This set of combs, it's a 10 pack comb set. I need these because I always lose my combs. I only have these two combs and I need more. So I got a whole 10 pack for like $3 I think. And it has all the combs, white tooth combs, rat tail combs, all the combs you need. So I got this. Oh, I got some, some more ponytail holders because I lose these so much and yeah so I just got me into more ponytail holders these were 88 cents there were some black regular elastic ponytail holders next thing I, next stuff I got was some lipsticks I need lipsticks like I don't have any lipsticks at all like I only have like two or three so I got some fall color lipsticks I got wet n wild brand and this one is like a dark plum red color and it says 535D is called Black Orchard. Orchard. This color is really pretty. It's just like a dark reddish color and I love it so much. Looks so good for fall. This is how it looks. Love it. The next color I got is 904B and this is in Rosebud. I gotta open it up because I didn't open these yet. This is like a Marvy. This one is about to say a Marvy pink. Oh my gosh, so pretty. Look, I love it. Love. And the next stuff I got from Walmart was like I got nail polishes. <laughs> like I have all these nail polishes over there, but like they're so old, I need to get new ones. So I mostly got Sally Hansen and I got one Pure Ice, which is a very cheap nail polish. The first nail polish I got is this color right here it's like a metallic -y, purpley reddish color it's this right here and it's called brown stone really pretty I haven't used that one yet um the next color i got is a like bluish color with, with a little bit of glitter and shimmer in it this is how it looks this one is called hard bitten and i've seen something on pinterest that had like snowman a snowman design and it looked just like this color so that's why I got it and it's like really cute I love it so I'll probably be using this around Christmas and New Year's the next color I have on my on my fingernails today looks like this and this is just like a mauve purpley reddish purple color this is called rockin' hard and it's so pretty I love it the next color I got is a light lightish purple this is also from Sally Hansen and this is called No Hard Feelings. The last Sally Hansen I got is in Hard as Nails Extreme Wear. I think, I think they all were the same price. This is just like a, a nudish pinky color. So this is how that looks. And this is called a Bear It All. This is really pretty. And the last nail polish I got from Walmart is a Pure Ice a Gold Glitter Nail Polish. The name of this one is called Studettes. So that's what I got from Walmart. So the next store I went to is Walgreens. I went there yesterday and I got more lipsticks, you guys. The first lipstick I got is called Breeze. These are also by Wet n Wild. Rosy, goldish, mauve colors that it looks. And I hope this looks, I hope it's like isn't too like sheer. Because to me it looks really sheer. Yeah, but it's sheer. I'll probably put that over one of my lipsticks. This next color is also like a deep dark burgundy red. In the color dark wine. Yeah, this color is like life. Look at it y'all. Like, it's so perfect for fall. Wow. Okay, you guys like. Are you kidding me? Like, look at this color right here, y'all. Oh my god. I'm gonna compare it with the other one. This one is the one of the squash is 536A. 
The one I have from Walmart is 535D. I'm gonna compare these two. They look almost exactly the one that I'm pointing to right here. That one is dark wine. This one is called Black Orchard. And this is like also like dark, pretty red, burgundy, brown. This has like more brown in it though. I'll swatch it. Oh wow. That's kind of weird color. I'll just have to see how this works out. It's like a brownish, goldish, oranges. It's right there, you guys. I've never seen a color like that that's used on the lips. But it might look good on my skin tone. You never know, you know? I think I would. Even though I don't go anywhere, I don't have a friend, don't have friends or anything like that, but really pretty. Those are all the lips lipsticks I got. Um, and then also at Walgreens, I needed to give me some more Eco Style and Gel. Yeah, I haven't used this in like months, and I finally got was able to purchase some, so I got it. I'm gonna be doing my yarn dress, so I need like some moisture and also some something to hold my hair together. So I got Eco Styling Olive Oil Gel. I love it. It's so good for my my braid outs, my twist outs, everything. I love this stuff, and my edges too. The last thing I got from Walgreens was. You know, Juicy Jazz gets me on this this cheap Wet n Wild stuff too. I got this Wet n Wild 10 eyeshadow palettes. For guess how much you guys? Three dollars. Yes, it was on sale for three dollars. I haven't swatched it yet. It has five shimmery shades and also five matte shades. You know, I love my neutrals, so I had to. This is my first time swatching this, so this is called. Coming in Latte, A229. Oh, look at this brush it comes with. It looks so nice. Ooh, this brush has a flat shader brush and then a, a fluffy blending brush. The colors are so gorgeous. I'm going to swatch them for you guys. Now that, they're not really too pigmented at all, you guys. They're not really pigmented at all. On my finger, they all, but like when I... Wash them on my arm. Not too pigmented. The shimmery colors are pretty pigmented. The matte ones, uh, not so much. So this is how they look. Not very pigmented, but like, if you use like a setting spray, it'll probably be more pigmented like always. So, yeah. I really like the brush though, so that's a good thing. The last place I went to was Dollar General today, and I got these dollar palettes. And I swatched one of them in the store. I just got not want to like waste the dollar, you know? These are by LA Colors. And LA Colors usually has some good, pretty good, you know, products for only being a dollar. This is like a pinkish, goldish, you know, it's like neutral color, basically. So I'm going to squash it on my finger and show you guys. See, look, look how pigmented that is. Watch it on my finger. Now, these LA Colors are almost better than the Wet n Wild. Like, yeah. This palette's pretty good. I don't like these brushes because it's like the, the cheap you know, the cheap brushes. So I don't use these. I'm gonna throw them away. A purple, most, most mainly purple. These aren't really pigmented at all. I like this color right here, and it didn't show up at all. Like this, this is that one right there. Not pigmented at all, you guys. Like that's that's really bad. Oh, I like the black. If I spray them with a shedding spray or water drops, they will probably work just fine. So for a dollar, they're pretty good, but I will, I will not repurchase this. So this is the end of my drugstore haul. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I'll see my next video to be very soon. Bye guys. Peace.